The ability to move virtual machines to different hosts without incurring an outage is a paramount capability required by virtual infrastructure admins these days. In this demo, we'll take a look at how you can use Red Hat OpenShift virtualization to live migrate your VMs across hosts with read-write many volumes provided by a Portworx storage cluster. For our demo, we'll be using our Portworx barbecue application, which requires a MongoDB database to store food orders from our fictional barbecue company. The MongoDB database lives on a virtual machine that's running on Red Hat OpenShift with the virtualization operator installed to manage virtual machines. The MongoDB database is running on a single node and is using a read-write-many storage volume provided by Portworx Enterprise. Read-write-many access modes are required for the live migration capability between hosts. We'll then migrate the MongoDB database to another node in the OpenShift cluster without experiencing downtime for our application. Now before we do a migration, we'll take a peek at our application and review our order history, which is stored in our MongoDB database. This shows that our connection to the database is working prior to any migrations that we perform. Now let's go to the OpenShift console and we'll find our virtual machine. We can see its status is running and it's on a node ending in Q5ZZL. Now we'll use the Kubernetes CLI to run a watch command on the virtual machine instance, which as you can see also shows the current node name. Now that our watch command is running, we'll go back to the OpenShift console and choose migrate to move it to a different node in our cluster. When we switch back to our Kubernetes watch command, we see that the virtual machine instance goes through some updates and the node name changes indicating that the virtual machine now runs on another node. We can also see the new node name from the OpenShift console as well. If we go back to our running applications, we can see that the application is still up and running and just to prove that we can still add data to the database and we're not pulling any tricks, We'll add another order to the database and show that the application still works without having to reconfigure any connection strings or anything like that. Live migration is a critical feature that any virtual infrastructure admin will demand to have in their environment. If you're moving to a Kubernetes-based solution for running your VMs, you can continue to live migrate your virtual machine instances with OpenShift virtualization and leveraging Portworx's read-write many volumes. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.